3D XCon is coming to Berlin. Sign up now to get early access to tickets and a 20% discount. These tickets will go fast, so don't miss out. Welcome, Welcome back to space. Back for the final, most likely, installment. What do you mean? No, it is the final. It <laughs> is the final installment. <laughs> of Stellaris Dev Clash Season 1. Yeah. The subsequent generation. It's been a wild ride. Wild ride, a long ride. 17 weeks. Yikes. We've been duking it out. Um, plus that one time we spent like 20 minutes in a game and then had to quit. So it's been a long time. We started this in October and we're finally at the point where we're going to give these up. It's going to be good. It's going to be great. And I'm hoping for to go out with one last amazing session. But yes. We shall see what happens. And we are good to go. Yeah, the Praetorian is incoming. Uh, the end of the cycle is going to happen in six years because someone, some dastardly scamp edited a save. <laughs> I, he, I, someone has been known to edit saves. It's uh, probably you. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I know how. I know how that how, how that works. You how you do that? You're excellent at save editing. Oh yeah. You just open it and you write. I would like this to happen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that that's how that works. <laughs> that's how it does. Yes. Make cool stuff equals yes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we have four also uh, bugs equals equals one. Yes. We have four <laughs> trophies to give out. We yes. have the. Fan favorite. Fan favorite. Which you guys are voting on, and the vote is not closed yet, and nope. it's very, very close. We will also be giving out trophies for best RP and the MVP. Those are decided by you, me, and uh, Dale. Yep. And finally, the wild card, which also, which we weren't originally planning on giving out, but we decided to add in the middle of the campaign because I think actually, we can, yeah, we can say that the FNG inspired us to create this, and. You might be thinking, all right, they inspired it, then uh, it, it's very obvious it's going to go to them. But no. it's not a given. We we've did, in lot... fact, uh, debate and discuss and vote on it. Yes, we've had a lot of good wild cards since then, actually. Yes, it's been good times. <laughs> yes. Oh, and I believe that the war has ended. Oh. The war between the NATO and the Chains and the family is over. Hmm. Let's see if we can get see a what statement happens. here. Uh, we have made from the Church of Chains. We have made peace. We have been informed that there was a clerical error when calculating tax. We have scheduled the clerk for future lashings, and have authorized tax uh, returns. I do believe you mean floggings. Um, well, uh, apparently the tax, tax return, return office. <laughs> yeah, so they gave up a bunch of few former USSR systems by the looks of things. This still has not been resolved. So I would no. like that to be fixed, as yeah. you guys said. But that's, of course, not concerning the Church of Shanes. It's concerning no, no, no. the Anarchists and the Omnorous Codex. Yeah. All right. So, the galaxy is quiet. Almost too quiet. Yeah. What did they say? The quiet, the calm before the storm? Yeah, I mean, the Day of Steve is approaching quickly. Yeah. I wonder if the way it's planning to... Do try it. and vassalize anyone else before the end. Oh, that's a different color. More what do you mean? Declared. F and G. <gasps> oh, oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, yep. Okay, okay. Uh, the A. First of all, the F and G has been kicked by NATO, I believe. Yeah. Uh, and the way has declared war on them to vassalize them. Uh, the F and G has repeatedly shown lacking judgment in associating this is with from the, the way. Yeah, from the way. In associating with the infernal machine. For their own good, we must protect them. And if they do not see the danger their leaders put them in, then this includes protecting them from themselves. For ascension is nigh, and none shall be left behind. Well done. So it appears that... Yeah, the NATO no longer wishes to protect the FNG. And the FNG have been declared war on in order to give them to Steve. Yeah. And they are the, the way fleets here. all over, and the only thing the FNG can say is, "What happened?" <laughs> <laughs> uh, NATO statement: FNG exit. The NATO Council has concluded that the FNG is exploiting our protection for individual gain while not contributing enough to the war effort. We hereby terminate their membership by unanimous vote, effective immediately. We wish them good luck for the future. <laughs> Doesn't unanimous vote mean that the FNG voted against themselves? Well, I, I assume they would not counting the FNG. I just think that would be 
very FNG like to vote it against that themselves. Way and the FNG fleet are now clashing in the Man of system. Mm. It's that a good system. It is a really good system. Yeah, that does not look like it will go the way of the FNG though. No, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, Here comes the way Corrette <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, this was indeed an, a no deal FNG exit. Um. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, and the FNG has surrendered. Well, that was quick. They have become a hassle on the way. Yeah, more <laughs> souls for Steve. Uh, <laughs> as a very quick surrender, but there was no and way they could And that means win. all their planets are now shroud marked. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> and now they are the RNG. <laughs> bless, bless RNGs. <laughs> Bless RNG. Oh, get those bless RNGs in chat. <laughs> Krugi says, wait, that means my planet is shroud marked. No. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and my hand Ilya proclaims religious nations of galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> he was prepared for this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and he honestly I got him was so surprised by invasion that they fleet the Black Corp in a moon. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's a place you can flee, I guess. I, I suppose. Well, um, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Is this true? The RNG ruler. So now we have the Eternum, the Way, the Florgal, and the RNG all as part. Oh, and of course the Nameless Ones. Yeah. All as part of the Great uh, Empire of Steve. Yeah. Question is, does the Way have time to attack the Batisu? Um. Can we check the leader of the RNG? Because they say that he's psionic. And I'm wondering if that's just them uh, having fun with it. Uh, no, he is, he is actually. He's psychic. So he has he has been granted a vision from Steve, which is why yeah. they surrendered. Clearly. Clearly. <laughs> it's obvious. Oh. Wow. Hmm. <sighs> so I guess man wore the blondie are about to embrace Steve. Uh, the Batista War is subjugation. Yeah, the way he has to declare the war again, this time on the AI. I guess they're gonna try for one more. Yeah, they have three years to finish it off. Question if, if is if they can. As far as I know, Omnihorse, didn't you already take some systems from the anarchists? Uh, yeah, I mean the... Yeah, <coughs> the SSR. The RNG SSR. took a bunch of systems. Yeah. The fact that you guys didn't only claim the capital is down to you. Yeah. What is that sy those two systems that are uh, uninhabited? If you want more compensation, you can always declare... Oh, and you have this system? What is the... That's the... Yeah, you the took the sentry. You took the sentry array. Yeah, I think on. that's more than enough compensation. Yeah. Don't make me send Dale over there to <laughs> yell at you. <laughs> also, Dale, this is a... Uh, Go I will wag my finger at you, so hear me, Steve. <laughs> it seems the anarchists are willing to not have their capital, apparently. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah. But no, I, I want them to have their capital back. Yeah, it yeah. was not a just seizure, but you can absolutely keep the sentry array. There we go. Um... Perfect. Thank you, boys. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, the Omni horses are going after the rogue AI. Okay. Yeah, that that seems like it. Seems like they will win that. Probably, yeah. <laughs> it may, unfortunately, be just looking at the amount of time have passed that the Praetorian have somehow bugged out. Oh. That is a shame. That that is very unfortunate, but was always a possibility with this yeah. old same. We got the contingency. I feel good enough about that. Yeah, I agree. Uh, probably the contingency will be dealt with this session. I think the contingency's days are numbered. Yeah. And the Nevlak Circle are still hanging on. Yeah, how many pops do they have still? Uh, 144. Wow. I think that's 
They're getting more pop somehow. <laughs> no. I don't think that's entire. Yes, they had less than that. Um. Well, I I think they ha have had people uh, for some reason. Maybe they're buying pops. That would be hilarious. I'm not sure if you're prevented from buying pops on the slave market, and I think the Batista are putting them up for sale because they're overcrowded. So. <laughs> Maybe we should look into that. <laughs> yeah, Stellaris team. You guys should probably look into whether you can actually yeah. buy pops to planets that are being occupied and bombarded because that seems... <laughs> that that's how they're keeping themselves alive. They are buying Batisu pops to exterminate instead of the Nivlax. <laughs> AI is next level. Yes. <laughs> that sounds like it's wad. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like working as intended. Uh, the Batisu are at 86% work exhaustion. So we are getting close to I mean, 100%. Ultimately, they still have to be <coughs> occupied more, though. 100% war exhaustion doesn't mean... Mm, okay. It does mean they're going to accept the status quo, at least. So yeah. the way we'll get something. Oh. Ah, sterilization yep, hub another, two. Yes. And I believe we can definitely say that the Praetorian are bugged by now. Yeah. Oh, that's sad. But oh well. At least we have, we'll always have Steve. Yeah. So there's one more system that the uh, contingency... Controls there. It's still control more regard. Oh, the nice. Like we have. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, okay. Hello oh, there. Oh no, that's Perfect. gonna wreak havoc on on uh, gravitation. <laughs> gravitation, gravity. Gravitation. Yeah. Yes. No <laughs> gravitation. You said it right the first time. I'm very tired. I have vacation next week. Uh, peace I, have moon. I have vacation this week. Yeah, you just come in <laughs> during just, your. I just wander in anyway. It's just like. Yeah. I to don't even work here, I just stream for some reason. To be fair, when you <laughs> told me what you were doing during vacation, it sounds like this is a good uh, vacation from your vacation. No, it's fun. I'm renovating our apartment. Yeah. I, this morning I, I was cutting floorboards, or sawing floorboards rather. It's fun. <laughs> <laughs> I know that I have to take out my vacation, because otherwise I will break myself. Uh, even though my vacation I'm taking next week... 0% for my vacation days, all from uh, working <laughs> overtime nice. during events. Approaching oh. the up. Oh no, they're coming! Oh my god, they're I just spoke super too slow! Soon. <laughs> oh. Yes! Yes! Wow! Check. I totally thought they were busted. <laughs> Alright, let's find out. Where are they coming? Can someone. I'll switch into Circadians. I'm hoping the Circadians are tracking their approach. The uh, Decaders are not tracking their approach. See, the Decaders are now track. Oh, they're coming here! In the shrimp! <laughs> In the shrimp, just like yes. you said! Yes! Everything <laughs> is as I prophesied! Hak, hak, hak! Hak, hak, hak! Boiled shrimp. Oh, oh boy. It's some good shrimp gumbo coming on here. <laughs> I'm an avatar of Steve! <laughs> oh man. That's oh, can oh, I get a rack macchia? <laughs> a shrimp sandwich? Yeah, sure. Yep. <laughs> Just gliding in on a shrimp sandwich, one of the best Swedish sayings. <laughs> and the uh, the anarchists are saying, I wish I could fortify things more. Uh, <laughs> and the Reflex are now selling bug spray at 10% off. <laughs> okay. What? This is when you hike the oh, price. Oh, the buddies who are defeated. They're Ooh. a vassal. And there's, and we're very there's only a few months left only until five Steve. Months left. Uh, who will enter the galaxy first, Steve, <laughs> or the the uh, the the Prithoran? Who who will actually come in first? Let's keep an eye on the shrimp. We will find out. Oh, they're not just in the shrimp. I think they're in the vassal of the Omnicupiters as well. Yeah, they're hitting uh, all alone there. Yes. Yes! <laughs> um, so apparently I'm supposed to read the TNN forum statement uh, now. So I'm gonna go find it. Little time remains, I shall not waste it with idle talk. Comet losses against the contingency have been heavy and the sabotage by their synthetic infiltrators have proven to be devastating for our fleet. Something, something, something. Um, we have introduced foolproof detectors to identify and remove any remaining oh. synthetic spies. Here they come! Ooh. 
Lot, lots more. You should go and read it on the forums. Here yeah, they it's come. It's a very long entry. Sorry, Turkidians. Yeah. The Praetorian Vanguard are here. <clears throat> Not to be confused with the Tuesday Vanguard. <laughs> hak, hak, hak. So they, yeah, they were two months early. Uh, Prithorin, we have arrived. Our long journey is over. Feed, mate, and rest. We must consume this galaxy before the hunters find us. Ugh. <laughs> well. And, and uh, the church chains are apparently being crisis deniers, uh, saying that it's just a it's hoax. It's fake news. Yeah, it's fake news. It's, it's just a hoax. <laughs> we didn't fall for the contingency. We're not going to fall for this one either. I mean, it's not so much a hoax as a hacks. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Mugani hak hak hak. Mugani hoax hoax hoax. Hoax hoax hoax. <laughs> <laughs> oh! It's all almost time. Okay. Uh, let's see. What if the game just breaks? Oh. Oh no. Did it? Oh no, come on, I Martin. I don't think it triggered correctly. No, <laughs> Martin! Oh. Martin! What have you done? I may not have set everything up properly. <laughs> <sighs> oh, this is that is uh, hella sad. <laughs> maybe, uh. they, maybe they already <laughs> just. Or Steve just saw the RNG and decided. How nah, about. Nah. No, actually. I'm, I'm good. Good. Um, <sighs> <laughs> apparently, Steve wants them to purge the galaxy of evil machines before he is willing to set any appendix on it. And the RNG. <laughs> they survived again, the RNG. I mean, are we willing to take a very short break? To fix it? To fix it. Can we? I think I can. <laughs> can we show this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, maybe I should give right. up on my yeah. other dating sim and just make a Praetorian dating sim instead. Yeah. How's that going, by the way? I've actually already working on it again. Oh, nice. Yeah, I... Because last year you said, I'm going to have it... Yeah, have no, I'm going to have the vertical slice done for PDXCon. Ooh. That's still what I'm aiming for. Nice, nice. So, I made an entire... I've been making an entirely new, like, file parsing and loading system because I'm a much better programmer nowadays than I used to be, so... <laughs> that will be handy for actually getting oh oh here we go oh my end of the rng and oh my god it is oh it is done yes and now uh, we will switch to hold on let me switch to the Arcadians to make sure we have vision of everything steve is here steve, steve is here. has returned um there vargalas Ah, oh, there we go. Steve. Steve. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh Pizzicato apparently dropped. So okay. Enjoy. <laughs> RNG rip. <sighs> this is definitely bad for business. <laughs> grab the land. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's going to be a uh, fun struggle to grab the land. <laughs> we'll, we'll have to look at it. Mama wants some shroud front property. <laughs> <laughs> it's free I real mean, estate. Bratton is obviously the player slayer here. <laughs> yeah. He's killed more players than anyone else. Uh, by far. <laughs> that's that's what? Three <laughs> players in in the span of one second. <laughs> and he has come. Uh, I'm not Steve, but I have come. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Steve <laughs> is most pleased. <laughs> um, something did go wrong, though. I think the Batizu avoided their fate. It yeah. seems so, but <laughs> I, well, there was, I guess there was some time to get. <laughs> Steve's arrival wrong. was a miracle that yes. required a little bit of. Oh. And I think we beat. Uh, we beat five thousand anyway. Pops. Situation. Okay. Yeah, the Patisu apparently somehow <laughs> Survived. got away, but... Yeah. The RNG did not. <laughs> I guess just the event that Shroud marks them didn't have time to fire would be my guess. Yeah. But, uh, oh, but well. oh well. I mean, yeah, you killed 
four people? Yeah, the, the way the Florigal, the Aeternum, and the FNG. This must be a first on uh, Death Clash to kill four players in one go. Yep. <laughs> Would have killed five, but damn the Batizus. Yeah, well, I mean, that wasn't a player. Not um, anymore, but neither is the Aeternum technically right now. Oh, oh, are, uh, oh no. Yeah, okay. alright. Oh no. <laughs> okay. We'll speed to Kalik again. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll see. We'll if... ignore it for now. Yeah. The show must go on. <laughs> we might... We'll see. Yeah, it's only 40 minutes left of the entire session. Um, so this is the very first time I've seen this, uh, this happen. So uh, Steve is there. How much yeah. is his... Uh, can you see his hit points? We cannot, because ah. it is obscured. Yes, You're not supposed to yeah. see that. But I believe this is the biggest possible Steve, which should be so well. several million, especially with the crisis scaling, sev maybe four million full Wait, power. Wait, it, it, it scales? scales? Yeah, he, he, count, he counts as a crisis. Yeah, so for, that, for that regard. Because I had... I think the Iternum had 1600 pops, I had 1100, Flargo had 900, and Enough. then uh, RNG had another 1000, and then Platicorp also had 500. So I think yeah. that's 5000 in total. Alright. There's a lot of other... Uh, <laughs> small incursions. Small, pop, like, uh, shroud manifestations around. Yeah, yeah. The, a lot of them. Do I still live somewhere, like my no. exiles? I didn't see that. Oh, uh, yeah, the, the, the termites are trying to kill one of the mini Steves. Here is here is uh, one of the ones who were, was left behind. <laughs> the final, the end, at long last, of the UNG. <laughs> we were standing. <laughs> what is the UNG's government in exile in Platicorp's comment on this return of Steve? We moved in time. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know what was going to happen? Because you were like, you asked me, what is Shroud marked? And I was like, I'll tell you after the session. <laughs> I don't know. Our government decided to evacuate all the important stuff, like, you know, cars, the government is skyscrapers from Earth. <laughs> the, the government is the only thing that mattered. <laughs> yeah. You know, people couldn't afford moving. <laughs> <laughs> well, they can't afford everything in heaven, so it's uh, it's fine. Does the 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 way of course, survive uh, somewhere? Are the is the way did you get did the way get moved to exile? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Do I have an exile anywhere? I didn't see. There may not there may not have been an appropriate planet. Oh, there. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're still there. You are. What? Where? Where? That's a very good question. <laughs> Are you Let's find out. Someone else's borders? Uh, you are in exile. In All right, Penosta. you can just search for exile. In Penosta. Uh, inside the contingency. Uh, inside. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> You're what? Is, uh, take, you have taken shelter behind the infernal <laughs> machine. They will never find us here. <laughs> this is a perfect uh, location. Apparently, to it's <laughs> already <laughs> occupied by. <laughs> We're being purged. Well, these were the dissenters. It's, oh, it's so fine. it's okay. So this planet was already fully purged by the contingency. Mm -hmm. So exile, the exiles ran to hide among the ruins. <laughs> I mean, we're, we came from a tomb world, so this makes perfect sense. It's a natural habitat for us. Oh. But uh, they were they were uh, heretics, and uh, they will now meet their fate. Yeah. We were so <laughs> prosperous, and you religious people <laughs> <laughs> turned our country into... <laughs> well, the religious, listen, I think the religious nations of the galaxy was the final true incarnation. It was, clearly. That is... Uh... Oh, oh, looky. Steve is fighting. <laughs> oh, is someone going after Steve already? What uh, is it? Did uh, Steve just die? Is no, this Steve? Steve? This is not Steve. This is one of the small ones. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, wow. <laughs> I There's a lot of small ones. Yeah, not sure where the big one is. Yeah, there infernal... we go. Absorb Vargal. <laughs> oh yes, it's moving. The infernal machine uh, is gonna go and attack it, I believe. So that is the omnibus. Yeah, I want to keep my eye on that. So, yeah. Ed, please keep an eye on. Oh, they have arrived. <laughs> Second wave. Please yell if there's something interesting happened with the Pretoria in the quickest. Right now, I want to keep my eyes on Steve. <laughs> I have to say, though, oh, poor Reflex, they're going to ascend next. <laughs> 
But I have to say, this was perfect timing because the Devouring Swarm arrived in the galaxy and we instantly ascended. It was like Steve knew and kept us safe <laughs> from the infernal uh, No, I mean, the, clearly Steve is not so much trying to keep you safe as he's trying to ascend the Praetorian to save them from the hunters. <laughs> ah, that's a good, uh, good plan. That's the next thing, yes. The hunters can't... Chase them all the way to the shroud. No, no. <laughs> it's just going to take him a while because he's just one one entity. Yeah. Steve. Mm. Unless Steve is the hunter. Mm. Universe couldn't handle so the appearance of the actual FNG. Steve. Oh, what's that? Uh, that's a fleet. That's multiple fleets from who? That's a good question. Situation log. Updated. From uh, the termites. The termites, and the termites are uh, claiming space, it seems. Yeah, F and G space. <laughs> oh yeah, that's man word. Yeah. Oh <laughs> wow. <man> word. <laughs> nice. Oh, the episode Vargles are in battle. Vargles? What? The Steve. Steve is fighting. Steve is fighting. Yes. He's fighting. Steve is fighting Reflex. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how they uh, do. It's not going so well for Reflex. Oh my God. <laughs> He's tearing through them like it's paper. <laughs> so uh, the Omni Horses wanted to maximize their fleet against Steve, and my my uh, I put it to the Omni Horses, try, I think <laughs> go ahead and try. I mean, yeah. they they did get some of his shield down. Yeah, but he has insane shield regeneration. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, and he has their much more hull than he has shield. I think their flexibility is quite bad with Steve. <laughs> no. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, Reflex had a fleet once. <laughs> well, I mean, Reflex was on the list of being vassalized to be ascended, so I guess they're just going to be ascended by different means now. Uh, and they still have a fleet, it's just still lost part of it. <laughs> oh, the Bloody Crows has managed to do something in this game, though, if you zoom out. That is uh, a, a new nice. game. Nice, the short of Steve Chains. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Excellent. And of course, there's a little bit of things going on down here as well. Yeah, <laughs> Praetorian. Taking their, they're taking some time, but... Uh... <laughs> yes. I wonder if anyone else is going to try to do anything... Uh... <clears throat> Against Steve? <laughs> yes, after this, uh, <laughs> this showing just now. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Warped yeah. consciousness Can they? reckoning. <laughs> hmm. Looks looks like a big jellyfish. <laughs> it does. It's a beautiful jellyfish. Steve, Steve has become an amazing entity. Hello, <laughs> Hello Reflex. <laughs> uh, <laughs> think fast. <laughs> <laughs> but Steve is still gone. a simple man. He still takes the the hyperlink network. <laughs> 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 Yeah, we need to rename him. <laughs> Vipsy Yummy. All right. Aspec is requesting a save file from the end game. I think we can oblige. Yeah, what yeah, do you yeah. mean by the end game, though? We'll like, say we'll say is uh, send you the hashtag blame Martin save. Yeah, that seems good. Which uh, uh, starts off with the end of the cycle. Yeah, that happening. sounds good. We'll get you that save, Aspec, and we'll see what you can do with it. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> we will do that. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure this. The space station will stop, Steve. Should we, <laughs> should we release that to the community as well? Why not? Just for fun. Why not? If you can run it. Tell you what, <laughs> we're just going to put it up for download in the uh, forum thread. Yeah. And link on Twitter and whatnot. So you guys can grab the save and see if you want to do something yeah. fun with it. If you can survive against Steve. Yes. If you can survive against both Steve and the age of the save. <laughs> <laughs> the double, the double, and the Praetorian. The, okay, the contingency of the Praetorian, Steve and the age of the save. And There's four crisis. RNG. Yes. You need to restore RNG. <laughs> yeah, that's the mission. Restore RNG. I mean, you can start as RNG. Let's see if you can yeah. save RNG in two days. <laughs> <laughs> All you have to do is annex the way in the yeah. one day. Yes, yes. <laughs> console commands are the future. Uh, I do believe you need, you need, commands. you're gonna need all the uh, uh, yeah. uh, DLC to play the save. Um, okay, I'm gonna look at the Praetorian for a bit, but if someone engages Steve yeah. and you don't tell us, I will come, I will to your come desk over and, and personally <laughs> slap you. <Yeah. laughs> okay, here come the Omni Horses. Yeah. Oh my God. What is a lot that? of fleets. 
Yeah. But I think he max maximized them against the Prothorans, so if he goes after Steve right now, like he's not gonna have time to... Uh, these are not looking maximized against the Prothoran. I think these are... No, they're uh, maximized continue? against Steve. Yeah, they're maximized against Steve. Oh. Um, naughty, naughty actually, boy. not really, because they've they've got lots of points. I think they're actually maximized against the contingent. Yeah, I don't think he's changed. I don't the layout think he's really changed uh, layout yet. Since uh, Aspex set them up, the family is saying they're going to take a stand against Steve, but I think they better hurry if they want to take a stand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're trying to stand with the uh, reflex. <laughs> Question is, can they? Will their fleets make it in time? Oh, oh they're oh. already up there. S gates instead of L gates. <laughs> oh, Reflex and the family are gathering. They're even sending in their transport fleets. Which... I guess they really want their armies to be ascended. <laughs> family, yeah, okay. Yeah, they're gathering quite a bit of fleet power here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, who are you going to place your, your money on, uh, Martin? I think Steve has this one. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> we don't like this Steve. We loved the Steve that was standing against the Khan. But this, well, is this one is going to eat the Khan at some point. No, the con doesn't exist anymore. It was absorbed by uh, the shrimps. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they were annexed. <laughs> but either way, I think uh, we might. We'll, we'll, we'll see how this goes. But we yeah. might also consider this sort of the battle between the Steve and the family as yeah, the yeah. ending point because I, think I so. don't see that anything too like. There's. I'm fairly certain the Omnivores can deal with the Praetorian. There's probably not that much else that needs to be resolved, and I, we do have trophies to give out. Mm -hmm. but can so. they uh, deal with Steve? Though? We'll see. We will see. Oh, Steve is moving again. So if you hear the, this pizzicato, go for Steve now. <laughs> <laughs> He's coming for Cyro. And it's the Echo Monopolis, the tech world of Cyro. Will they actually make it in time to engage? I wonder. Well, no, no, they did not. <laughs> Goodbye. Om Let's om watch om. it get shrouded. Beautiful. You just you destroyed the galaxy. I did not. I'm ascending the galaxy. Everyone's <laughs> going to the beyond and away from this infernal machine that is uh, currently fighting it out with the scourge. I mean, it's not on. So much an Echomonopolis as Echomestipolis now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Nom nom nom. I mean, it sure takes its time. It's not even moving right now. I mean, it takes basically it takes a short break between each. Ah, I so see. it is yeah. slow and methodical. This is gonna look like a pentakill at this stage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here it comes. There's com something coming out. Uh, <laughs> one, one <Lunch>. battleship. <laughs> okay, let's see. We have the Descorax Seven. The Descorax Seven is engaging Steve. Battle. Battle. Oh. <laughs> he took like three or four shots. That not, that's not bad. No. <laughs> Battle oh, uh, the way oh. was just cleansed by the contingency. Well, oh. th those were the heretics. We've established that those were not representative of the way. But this does mean that there are no Vargals in the galaxy anymore. Okay. <laughs> Another goal. Well, <laughs> Do, uh, I no. Uh, no unfortunately, X. Captain Leroy Jenkins did not survive. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh. I don't want to see Fs for Vargals that were traitors. Okay, these are these are heretics. No Fs. Let's see. Um, I think the uh, the Tarkardian Utopia has said that they they've uh, cleaned out the uh, Praetorian. Oh wow! <laughs> I think that's what he means. Yeah, I mean. Oh, here they go. Both, both the Tarkadians <clears throat> and the Cyborgs. Absolutely. All right, let's make sure we don't miss this. Oh. oh, oh. <laughs> the okay, here we go. Space. The entire family. Battle commences. Steve protects. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Let's see how this goes. And I think this will be our capstone. Yeah. Even though I talked about going longer, because just, yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, damn. <laughs> Steve, it might not have been the strongest thing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, Steve no. is gone. No. Jesus. <laughs> just see what you've done. <laughs> wow. Wow. Mind blown. <laughs> Your religion was I wonder fake. if... Yeah, maybe Steve needs some rebalancing. <laughs> that oh was, uh, 
You should have had like a million, two million. I you should have had sold way more than that. RNG yeah. for that? Well, <laughs> you was... sold RNG for that? No, 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 I sold RNG just to watch you die. All right. <laughs> Me die. That was that uh, is the cost. That was an anticlimactic <laughs> ending, but an ending nonetheless. <sighs> Let's finish it up. <laughs> <laughs> Now you can have Fs. Now I want to see Fs. All right. It is time for trophies. Yes. Everything didn't go quite as planned, but it was a hell of a ride. <laughs> oh, it up. was. It was a lot of fun. No. <laughs> He's running away with them. <laughs> if you run away with the trophies, you only deserve the wild card trophy. <laughs> I'm not standing nearby <laughs> this guy. Uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Satisfying, right? Just watching the UNG. <laughs> <laughs> They got was yeah, they got got Fanny 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 I think that's a good <laughs> I think that's a good tagline for this dev class. <laughs> Things didn't it. quite go as planned. You can hold this. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> How am I? Let's see, let's make sure we all get uh, room here. Yes. Mm -hmm. Also do we have do you see any nominees that are missing? Oh God, I mean, so you shocked. had the biggest legacy in Steam. <laughs> <laughs> you created the religion. Yeah, I and then Steam that was happened. defeated. And at right? least not for the first category. Uh, we can start with the first category. So, the wild card. The, <laughs> Given trophy, the trophy that was introduced as a wild card in the middle of this the season. Given to the plan. player that sows the most chaos and acts in the most unpredictable <laughs> ways. Yes. So, the nominees are... Uh, FNG or RNG or UNG <laughs> or USG. <laughs> USG. Was there a name that I forgot? UNG. RNG. <laughs> That's all of them, I think. Uh, uh, Church of Chains and the Anarchists. Uh, and the winner of the Wildcard Trophy is the UNG uh, USG. RNG. FNG. RNG. You each get one call. <laughs> In the end, nobody else was able to quite match the amount of chaos and surrender to success that, that the UNG turned into a quite unique and entirely unprecedented strategy in dev class. He didn't even bother to resist against me, he was yep. just like, surrender, okay, and he surrendered. I didn't understand what happened. <laughs> if it hadn't been for Martin's safe magic, he would have gotten away with it too. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh my. But just right. as Steve's justice reaches all. There is all no right. justice. So, second trophy is best RP, the best role player, and I want to get all the... Uh, uh, We've got all, a lot of all, all the nominees uh, forward when I call you. So we're gonna start with the socialist hedgehogs, or can you say how it's supposed to be said? Socialistische <laughs> Retterrepublik. All right. We also have the family and Platicorp. So let's get uh, family and Platicorp in here. To make sure that uh, you're all here. Yep. All right. And the winner of the uh, best role playing, uh, m largely dictated by the fantastic photoshopping goes to the family. Yes! Yay! Well deserved! It was close between uh, the family... It was close both, but in the end, it's just the photoshop yeah. won it. Yeah. <laughs> we had, I'm happy they were appreciated. <laughs> we had to go to an extra vote for that one uh, to make sure that we had one win winner, because we only had one trophy. Uh, then we have the MVP, and let's see. Oh dear. Um, so, first off, we have the Omni Horses. Way in the back. Let's uh, <laughs> let, let's try and get the Omni Horses forward. Yeah. Um, I mean, I mean to talk. <laughs> <laughs> I've got the nominees now. Uh, the Church of Chains and the Way. Uh, All right, and the winner of the MVP, I think, is one that came from out of nowhere. Uh, kind of like a dark horse. Kind of like a dark horse. <laughs> is the Omni Horses. Yay! Yes. <laughs> then, so, lastly, oh, we yeah. have the fan favorite. I have the vote here, um, but it might have changed since I look, last looked at it. But let's lock so, it now. We're locking it now. 
at 1,069 nice. responses. Nice. <laughs> uh, in third place, we have the SSR, Ooh. or SRR. <laughs> nice. uh, in second place, the Omnihorse Codex. <laughs> And in the uh, first place, and in first place, the UMG. UMG. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. What? <laughs> all right, that is it, everyone. Thank That's you the all. First Dev Clash. Thank you all so much for playing for 17 <laughs> weeks. Uh, even though some of you took a, a small uh, uh, leave of absence every now and then. Um, thank you everyone for watching, this has been amazing. Almost nothing went as planned, but everything <laughs> went great. <Yes. laughs> we'll, uh, we will have news about the next Large Dev Clash at some point in the future. Until then, we'll see you. Goodbye! Bye. Farewell! Bye.